Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario 64 with my feet. Hello. Uh, Hi. Yep. As usual, we have Dazzling Outer and Brother Entropy with me, and today we're going to be taking on a boss and finishing up the basement. Well, yeah, and you'll forgive me if I can't muster that much enthusiasm, because, yeah, you'll see. <laughs> there, there's a little something in the way first. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I love this level. Yep, the basement has one, more, one last hurrah, and it's a... Uh, Rather painful. Not a very one. fun one. <laughs> Welcome to the second water level, Dire Dire Docks. Nice um, name. It's, it's a lovely name, but as it's, you can see right here, it's very boring and dire. Im yeah, dire implies like you know, interesting. <laughs> yep. Or tension or something. Okay, like. okay, here we go. You've just seen the entire level. <laughs> yep. It's it's one room and then a big long tunnel with nothing in it and then another room and there we go. On the plus side, we'll have a Bowser battle in the middle to kind of break up the not the monotony. Monotony. <laughs> and there's a submarine. And there's a sub here that won't be here for long though. Which apparently it's Bowser's. Well, it has his face on it. I would, I would give it. Do note that if you try to land on anything that is not wooden plank, you will slide off. Oh, of course. Here's Luckily, the star is easy, and this thing disappears real quick, like so. We don't have to worry that much about it. Yeah, it's a very pointless submarine. Mmm, rather. For some reason, they, like, they make you do one level of this. I think there's, they sort of start to put a story into it, but not really, and then they give you into this. Yeah, like, what is, what does a sub have to do with this, like, lava area? Like, it was a I lava don't know. sub. I don't get a Nintendo. <sighs> <sighs> no, nothing makes sense, but welcome to Bowser and the Fire, Fire City. I guess they were, they were going for something. Yeah. Like, they were going nice for something, level. but, like, it didn't really connect. I think maybe the text explains it well, but who the hell ever reads the text? Nah. Nah. I doubt it would really make it much more sense. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I guess there's there's water, and that's a sea, and then this is a fire, a fire sea? Yeah, that's like a weird... Like I said, it's a fire sub. <laughs> Perfect. Then why was it in water? Anyway. Um, as usual with this level, we have to collect eight red coins, and that'll be the only star ah. here. And I will hit the water, I'll hit the lava a whole bunch of times. Fortunately, they kind of That's anticipated fine. that and gave you a health refill. That yep. never ends. I love those hearts so much. Also, it turns out these aren't coins, but I don't know why I would have gotten. Oh wait, they are coins, but I don't really have much of a reason to get them anyway. <laughs> Silly me. The Bowser levels always struck me as kind of odd. Yeah, like it's it's, it's different very because linear. It's, yeah, exactly. For, I mean, I guess that's kind of the worse. point of them. Also, this is a red coin that's really easy to miss. Oh, that's a main that's a main yep. one. Especially because there really isn't any way to get it except falling. So no matter what you do, even if you know it's Ooh, there, nice you have catch. to go through the whole thing. That was pretty close. So yeah, I guess these are more explicitly obstacle courses than other levels, but some some of the set pieces just don't make sense, like this Lego box. <laughs> yeah, the cage box, and I also really liked how they wanted to get some vertical space into this level, so they added new layers of lava as you go higher up. Yeah. I thought that was pretty funny. It, it's so, like some sort of Dwarf Fortress Doomsday contraption. <laughs> It's wonderful. It's like, okay, so we can't make this level too long. Let's let's build it up a little, but but there's lava on the bottom. Yeah, like that's the whole point. That's the whole gimmick. I have an idea though. Let's let's just make a ton of lava layers. Yeah, I I don't know what's up with this. <laughs> oh, by the way, see that uh, that little uh, plated thing with the little dents and dimples in it? Mm-hmm. That actually doesn't come into play until, like, the end of the game, but it lets you defy <laughs> gravity. It's really cool. Wait, what? Yep. I, I actually, now I realize what he's talking about. Well, we won't be seeing that until the final Bowser yeah, level. Yeah, I, I do not remember that at all. It's really just a texture that was applied to some strange thing. I, I just gave you something to look forward to. You should thank me. Oh, boy. Spoilers. Also, I'm lucky I grabbed that, because then we'd have to see me walk all the way around. God knows we don't want that. Oh, no, we wouldn't. Well, you, you would have edited just, it out. Just, yeah, you would have a good it. point. Or maybe I'd have made you watch it. Unless you're some sort of sadistic asshole. <laughs> well, we haven't established whether or not I am that or not. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, we have. 
On the plus side, the third level is the final one, so we're almost done here. As the red coins tell us. I kind of like the Bowser levels as, like, you know, normally the game's all about exploration, but this one's a challenge thing, so... So yeah, it's like a little gauntlet for you. It's, it's, you know, it's, it's different. It changes things up. I think I always found this one to be the easiest. Yeah, I, th I think I agree with that. Because you can't fall to your death. You get three tries. Yeah, yeah the lava will always catch your fall. <laughs> yeah, the lava is some. Yeah, it's like less, less intimidating than just a giant hole. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, even if you've been collecting the... Whoops, I guess I forgot to edit a bunch of those out. Never mind. Even if you've been collecting the... Uh, <laughs> I thought you were just, like, uh, taking things. pictures. <laughs> even if you've been collecting the red coins, I should just leave those in. You probably kind of have to go out of your way for this and do some of those double wall jumps we saw in Hazy Maze Cave. Right. This is a much better level than Hazy Maze Cave, though. So. Oh, absolutely. This the the obstacle course thing kind of works well for it here, because while Hazy Maze Cave was like weird, You're this one weird. is this the while Hazy Maze Cave was spread out, this one is like normal. <clears throat> so it's not just me blinking spontaneously. This is the video <laughs> blinking spontaneously. Yeah, this is what I tend to remove from my post commentary or from it before I show it to you guys, but. I guess I missed some numbers on Avicent or something, because there were a bunch of them right there. Oh, yeah. Well, my Still lips going. are sealed. <laughs> Except they're anyway, not. Anyway, Bowser. <laughs> on the plus side, it's only because the level's red, so as soon as we go back to the boring part, it'll stop flashing that, so much. It is really weird. So Bowser can teleport now. Yep, that's really strange. I don't remember that. Yeah, that's... That's really bizarre. It's it, the weird thing is he only really does it in this level for some strange reason. He's also lost the fire, fire breath. He just like spits out little fireballs. If I remember correctly, it's been a while. <laughs> that makes it, no, it makes it kind of pain in the ass to get him. Yeah, it really does. Like honestly, this Bowser fight is difficult only because he because just runs around all the yeah exactly because he teleports all the time. What was that? <laughs> did you, like, get hit by fire, but it didn't count? And then uh, get hit by fire for real? <laughs> well, I wasn't going to bring that up, but... <laughs> oh, Too okay. bad. Go look at the Skype window real quick. <laughs> We're going to keep this quiet. Ah, you're, you're not very good at this, are you? Anyway. I, I'm sorry I'm bad at covering up your stupid amateur mistakes. Jeez. <laughs> wow. Get a little rude in here. This never, this never would have happened if I was at the helm. We would have just been watching beavers by now. <laughs> we would have, and the audio would have been in sync, but... Well, I didn't say that. Shh. You're, the one who, you're the one who let the cat out of the bag. Mom, Dad, stop fighting. <sighs> you never take me anywhere anymore. On the plus side, I think I get him on this shot, so we'll be done with this. Any second now. Assuming I ever let him go, of course. <laughs> are, are you just gonna... Is your strategy to make him vomit to death? Yes, it, it just takes me a long time to get him, I swear. <laughs> Seriously, wow. <laughs> we got this, we're on top of this. I thought I remember him doing that, like, ground pound move more. Nope. No? Or... I think you can kind of you can get him to do it if you're like really far away from him. Oh, maybe that's what it was. Then. Um, I remember that he likes to do it if you toss him off the side and miss. Oh yeah, that, he, yeah. when he jumps back on, he does it automatically. Oh yeah, that, that sounds right then, because I probably missed a lot. Mhm. Mm I don't know how I've managed to beat two Bowsers on the first throw Bad now. Bad at games. I'm pretty okay with that. And I'm gonna mute, mute the video now because it's like a second ahead. I'm telling you, I'm not the one who said it. It was all you. <laughs> Might as well admit it. It'll be good for you guys, the viewer, though. Maybe. Oh, that, that's reassuring. Ah, oh, welcome back to Dire Dire Docks. <laughs> this level, it's, it's it's just not good, honestly. For some this reason, bring back I've... the blinking and the audio desync. I remember thinking it was bigger. It's not. It's it's really tiny and it's really boring. 
I think I just like imagined it was bigger because I don't know. Like, <laughs> I only saw the two rooms and like assumed there was more because I was a dumb kid. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Maybe there's stars I'm not getting. Nope, it's just two rooms. Okay, so anyway, and this it it, it yeah, feels ahead. so much bigger than it really is because you're swimming everywhere. Yeah, I guess that's part of it too. That's true. It's really really slow. Anyway, this this level is another one of those open the chests things. Except it's even more annoying. It really is, because you might not be able to see, but I'm getting pulled in by the big whirlpool in the center, and that will kill you if you're not careful. So, like, if you get into it, then... yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and if you get too close to it, but you don't get in it, you get, like, stuck for a while, and you have to, like, mash the A button or you die. Yep, you'll get to see that, don't worry. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm demoing that. Oh, boy! Oh, sure. <laughs> Whatever you want to call it. <laughs> that is exactly what I want to call it. Anyway, there's there's not much to say about it, because it's literally just, you know, the same thing that we did in Jolly Roger Bay, except now there's something that will kill you pulling you in the whole time, and that makes this chest a bitch and a half. What I've found is the best way to do is basically exactly what you were uh -oh, doing. Uh -oh. Yeah, exactly. Just kind of you, you kind of got to run into it and hope you trigger the thing because there's there isn't really an exact button for opening up the chest. Yeah. It's just sort of shove your face in it. Mhm. Mm hope you hit the trigger. Mm. Mario's nose is the key. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Eventually I kind of just try pulling out and going straight in for it. This is kind of dangerous, That's an though. unfortunate way to phrase things. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't I say it? <laughs> well, I was. Deal with it. I have no idea oh. what you're talking about it. Oh, by the way. Good job. Good job. Really? Yeah, yep. you're, you're dead now, aren't you? Oh, God. Yep. <laughs> Don't do that, kids. <laughs> you're not going to make it to lessons again, right? Oh, God, no. Not cruel. This time it actually works. Unless I decided to put a death reel in here. I guess we'll see. <laughs> Just admit that you don't remember either. Oh no, I know. Well, he's not in the like the right mindset for remembering stuff right now anyway. That's also true. Corona's pretty good. On another note, there we go. <laughs> There's the star. I think the joke is that alcohol has been consumed here, but I could be wrong. No, that's, that's definitely the joke. <laughs> On the plus side, we got another star, and I think the rest of them are quick, thanks to a liberal use of speed up and jump cuts. Well, we've got ten minutes and like what five stars. <laughs> that's a that's a good way to look at things. I'm I'm happy that you're seeing it doing that way. math. That too. I don't. Well, why are you doing math? It's June. <laughs> <laughs> and we're in college. You should be like past the point. Well, I'm I'm not. That's a good point. Anyway. I decided that all of this was not worth watching at normal speed, so... There oh, you go. you're getting the Thank 100 God. coins? <laughs> yep, I'm, I'm getting the coin star. How many how many coins are in this, like, all together? If I had to think, I, I think it's like 107 or so. Okay. Not That's... much margin for error. Nope. Yep, so you gotta get pretty much everything, so I'm just... I'm. There's, there's nothing worth watching here, is the thing. Yeah, really. <laughs> Like, we're, we're collecting all these coins that we saw the first time around, so there's, you know, bleh. Yeah, it's so that, exactly. one, that one room we've been in the whole time. Yep. Oh, but now we're changing rooms. Uh, uh. Yep. And I wasn't, I wasn't going to show you that at normal speed, because there's nothing in there. Anyway, the coins, the, the coins that we're going in are dicks. Also, note that big opening. Go, go ahead and explain it. If you go in there, you will be sorry. Yep. That's... Do you go hmm. in there? No. Okay, God, then no. I will Ex explain. Explain it, yeah. You end up not outside the level, but outside no. in the moat. Yep. Which oh, is now... Like, drain. They, like, kick you out of, out of the whole level, and, like, you're back in the, like, the castle mm -hmm. area? The, the little lake near the castle, oh. yes. It's, 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 it's one of two places but that The farthest sucks. possible way away. It's basically... And the funny thing is, when you get a game over, it kind of puts you right there, like, at the start of the level. So basically, going out there is equivalent to a game <laughs> over. <laughs> I don't wow. even think you lose a life. You just end up there. Nope. <laughs> that, it's that, just, that's just taunting that, him. Yeah, like, it's kind of funny, but it's also kind of a dick move. <laughs> 
Don't worry, kind of there evil. will be more of that going on. Yep. I don't think I ever actually fell prey to one of those traps, though. Spoilers. Anyway, we are collecting literally every coin here because I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to be able to collect all of them. Right. <laughs> it's, it's just that bad. I guess they never really figured out where to put coins on water levels because you're always really just scrounging around for yeah. them. Yeah. I think it's more that, not that, more people just never figured out how to do water levels. There's that too. Anyway, now we get to the second part of the level, which really only reinforces things. I'm gonna... I'll speed up a lot more of this, but you really have to get the effect. We're on some poles that move really, really slowly. Just look at that. <laughs> this is so incredibly dire. Isn't it? Uh, yeah. Like, this is, this is the exact point that in this level that you realize that the entire thing... This is the full thing, level. Yep, that the entire level is just things that slow your movement down. Either you're swimming in this gigantic lake what? that has nothing interesting in it... It has fish! ...or you're kind of just... Why did ...sliding along. Why did I have the impression that people like this level? I don't know. Because, like, I, I, like I, I remember that, but then I'm like... It has, why, it has why fish. They, the, like... the, the rest of, like, any pole segment is just going to be sped up. I, there, there's no reason to just watch these things go and have nothing happen. Yeah, there's no fish here. Exactly. There's even less well, to this than the rest least, of the level. At least the blue coins are easy. <laughs> that too. I'm, I'm really happy, even though I almost managed to not get them. <laughs> I mean, yeah, but if, we're okay. If you missed one, that means... Yep, 102 coins in the level. <laughs> on the unfortunate thing, I just oh. fall down here, but it's not worth showing because I just oh, go yeah. around it's, it's and really go nuts. back up. It's, it, it, like, so much of this level isn't worth showing, and that's kind of unfortunate. Like, kind like, of? I'm kind of getting, like, DK64 flashbacks now. Like, we start off all excited, but then we're like, uh, all these metal parts kind of suck. Well, 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 on I mean, the bright side, the later levels are genuinely good. Yeah, I was gonna say it improves again. It's just like a weird deja vu mm -hmm. effect I was getting. But yeah, like I don't know. There's nothing. There's there's nothing to this level, unfortunately. And like I, we could we could shit on Hazy Maze Caves, but this is really the point in the game. This isn't even fun to shit on. This is me pausing the game so that I can check game facts and find where the rest of the coins are. Just oh, I thought record. you were an expert. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not on this level. I spent as little time here as I could. <laughs> I can see why. And, yeah, there's just, like, the whole thing is just tedious as hell. It's, it's like, by this point, I want this video to be over so much that I skip over the message that says, Hey, you've got 70 stars, now you can fight the third Bowser. <laughs> Before, Even though we haven't been at the second level. Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> we just barely the got second the, story, the second whatever. key. Mm-hmm. The game's kind of set up that way, like, there's just enough stars to beat the last yeah, Bowser on yeah. the very beginning, and there's there's a ton of stars left, but they're all really, you know, challenging. Yeah, unless you skip a lot of stars. Mm-hmm. Thank God. I mean, in its defense, DK64 was like that, too. Mm-hmm. True. You had to get 100 bananas. Yep. Honestly, th this is the low point of the game, I hate to say it, but... Yeah, that's like, the basement is kind of, yeah. So the basement has some good levels, but it, it really it just gets better as you go on from here. It gets there's the levels with things in them. Yeah, like it's, it's just like the, it depends the on whether or not you count Big Boo's Han as a basement level or not. Mm, hmm. Not really. It's it's on the first floor, and it's a really good level. So well, yeah, but if you think of it as a basement level, then it's like, <laughs> oh wow, the basement's not that bad. <laughs> <laughs> Why didn't you do that the last time? <laughs> Why didn't you do this for the entire video? <laughs> the whole video is just BSing. Why bother? I got six no more stars. No one would blame us. Yep. We, we had, yes, they would have. <laughs> We're showing off everything. Ah, take another swig. <sighs> this is a weird star. What, what is the. Yeah, Isn't what? this like something you do exactly the same in Jolly Roger Bay? Nope. No, this is something you do I twice here. I what? <laughs> Just you wait. It's it's kind of an interesting thing. It's basically get five rings in a row, and then it makes a star appear. 
But <laughs> as we will see in the near future, they kind of thought of this idea and thought it was so cool that you would be able to do it, do it right away again. Huh, I know but I first, we gotta float through the scenery. Is that I feel coral about that. or those pipes or what? I, I, think I it's thought coral. it was coral, but yeah, like once you get closer, it's hard to tell. Mm, you, you also go right through it. You you can't actually walk on it or anything. It's a ghost coral. Yep. Sure. <laughs> I'll go with that. <coughs> anyway, we're we're on to star five, which is the manta rays reward. You know what you gotta do for this star? Nope. I do, but I'll leave them in suspense. I yeah, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, you do know because it's the exact oh. same thing as last level. With a twist. Well, at least it's at least you're following something, I guess. I don't, I don't know. Like <laughs> it's it's slightly more challenging, but at the same time, it kind of just makes you think, boy, this level's boring. <laughs> yeah. They couldn't really think of anything to put in this level, could they? And so you There's can't. There's a manta ray. So you can't miss any. Like you have to do. Yeah, it's five in a row, and that, yeah, that is admittedly more difficult than swimming straight down, but at the same time... You, you don't really need I both. I feel like I've seen this mechanic before. They might, they, they could have at least waited for, like, another level to do this. Yeah, like, put, but, put the last one in Jolly Roger Band, put this one in here, so at least it's, like, marginally different. Mm-hmm. Although, the star does throw a dick move at you in right putting there. the star right above the death pit. Wow. <laughs> this level just hates so, you. We, we can watch me just attempt to get this thing for a little while. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, Underwater it. stars are the best. Especially when something's trying to kill you right below the star. Look at the fish. I, I, think, that's, <laughs> I think that's a little cheap cheap. They're, they're very nice Probably. fish. I like them. At least we already got uh, the bunnies. So we don't have to put up with that. I thought there was more bunnies. They put more of those in in the remake. That made me sad. Oh, okay. That's what I was thinking of. <laughs> Well, actually, there are two bunnies, but on the video that we haven't watched yet because we're doing these out of order, I kept the second one. Spoilers! I thought I... God damn it, Vickis. I'm having so much fun right now. You're just, just breaking all, this breaking video. Breaking all your rules. And by this point, it doesn't matter anymore, so we're just going to warp straight into there. This is actually a moderately interesting star because this is pretty much the only time this happens in the entire game. Because here we have to catch collect two caps. Huh. I don't really know why they never did anything with that, this yeah, in the entire like rest neat, of the game. It seems like a neat kind of gimmick thing, like combining things. Yep. Because basically, you need the vanish cap to get through there, but you need the metal cap because you can't swim fast enough to get through that little grating that we see over there. Oh, huh. See, I yeah, want to see, like, metal cap and flight cap together. That would be pretty hilarious. <laughs> I can't really imagine anything you, you do with yeah, them. Yeah, he's, like, he's like fall like a stone. Like, how would that work? <laughs> oh well, sure looks like we're done. What out. a shame! I know oh, it's just darn. terrible. This video was so interesting that I didn't even fall asleep after it. Why is it shaking? Is there an earthquake? Because Lakitu is caught on an edge here. I also I'm, I'm showing off camera glitches. That's what. And then I got so annoyed with it that I said, "Fuck it." <laughs> <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed. No.